Hello, and welcome to HamiltonBackClinic.com. I'm Dr. Anthony Lombardi. Nice of you to join us uh, perusing our website. It's, it's new and up and running, and part of our website is that we're going to be adding on every week or two podcasts we'll be to inform you about different things like muscle and joint related injuries, and what's available in terms of treatment, in terms of modern manual medicine. So we're going to do that today. I'm going to take you through some of the... Uh, the different questions that I've been having and primarily today the question we're going to be focusing on is does acupuncture hurt? Patients are always saying, Dr. Lombardi, I'd like to have acupuncture, but does it hurt? You know, I heard it hurts. The answer briefly is no, it doesn't hurt if it's done correctly. So take, take me down here. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? Good. So what we're going to be doing today is focusing on the acupuncture and before I do that I'm going to be telling you a little bit about the different types of Hello. And relaxed tissue. There's two different types of acupuncture. One, the traditional Chinese approach. The traditional Chinese approach focuses on the balance of the body's energies. You may have heard of yin and yang. Now, in order to do that, typically the approach is putting needles everywhere, the hands, face, head, in order to balance the energies. That's fine. With medical acupuncture, is the acupuncture that I uh, that I utilize on patients is different and in my opinion more effective for muscle and joint related pain because just for that it is geared towards muscle and joint related problems so instead of using 60 or 70 needles we use 4 to 10. Mario here he has a supraspinatus tear of his right shoulder now we're not going to get too technical here because uh, we're going to use that for future podcasts but basically and I think we're going to get zoomed in here, I'm going to needle the supraspinatus muscle uh, itself. So what you're going to feel here, Mar, is a little bit of a pinch, okay? And now the needle's in. How did that feel? Painless. Painless, of course, because this is the painless insertion technique. So using this technique and using it correctly not only makes it a pleasurable experience for the patient, but it's very effective in terms of putting together a treatment. So I'm going to proceed and insert about six needles and you can see how quick it is. This doesn't have to take forever uh, in terms of inserting the needles. If it's done quick and effectively, someone who's highly trained, this can be a very pleasurable experience and more importantly help improve the patient's uh, symptoms. Again, if you have any questions at all about what I'm doing, like I said, this is to educate and inform you. Regardless of where you are, please email us at info at Hamilton back do as I keep the patient here for a period of uh, four to five minutes and and, and go from there so uh, just to wrap up the, the podcast here the purpose of this podcast was does acupuncture basically took six uh, needle insertions along with electric stimulation easily and comfortably which is most important so that's the first key in effective treatment if you're afraid of the treatment, the treatment's not going to work. So you have to keep the patient relaxed. Here at Hamilton Back Clinic, that's our, our goal. We want to make sure that you're, you're not anxious about anything that when you walk in the door that you're going to feel confident that not only you're going to feel better, but you're going to have fun doing it. Okay? So uh, I'm going to keep uh, Mario on here for a couple more minutes. All right, how are you feeling? Okay? Good. Super. And, uh, and then we'll go from there. Thank you for your time. Be sure to tune in. Uh, every week or two. Typically the goal is every two weeks there will be a new podcast uh, on, our, uh, on our website. If there's a topic you'd like me to touch upon and I get a lot of uh, emails requesting that topic, uh, please feel free to let me know. So email us at info at hamiltonbacklink.com. Have a nice day.